Hey everyone, John here from testprepinsight.com and today I'm gonna to be doing a quick comparison of the MCAT prep courses from Blueprint and Kaplan. These are two of the most popular MCAT prep options on the market and I wanted to provide an overview of our thoughts on how they stack up and which one you should use. But with that said, if you do want some more information or detail regarding these courses at any point, make sure to check out our full detailed written comparison of these two programs over on our website. An easy way to get there is just to Google Test Prep Insight Blueprint versus Kaplan MCAT. It's the quickest way to find it. All right, so rather than breaking down and reviewing each MCAT prep package in detail, since we have full review videos on each that go deep into the details, I'm instead gonna focus on how these courses differ so you can make a decision on which is best for you. Because luckily each course is a little different and has unique strengths that makes one or the other better for different learners and situations. So that's what I'm gonna talk about today. I'm gonna highlight the unique strengths of each course and then I'll bring it back at the end for some final thoughts on who each is best for. So with that said, let's start with Blueprint. Although there's a lot of similarities between these MCAT courses, there are three big differentiators that we found with Blueprint. And the first by far is their video lessons. To put it simply, Blueprint's on-demand video lectures are the best in the MCAT prep industry by a mile. They're engaging, the perfect length, easily understandable, and the instructors are awesome communicators. The videos all feature your instructor on screen and they're filled with cool graphics, cartoons, and visuals to help hold your attention and demonstrate points. This is particularly true for the complex chemical processes and physical systems that the lessons break down, they're illustrated right on screen next to the instructor, which I think really helps you to understand the material better. Some of their MCAT prep companies on-demand video lectures are just boring slideshow style lessons with voiceover like Princeton Reviews, but Blueprint's video lessons are seriously awesome. And just as a reference, we actually don't mind Kaplan's video lectures. They're actually pretty good in their own right and they're light years ahead of others like Princeton Review and Magoosh. But if you're a visual learner, it's gonna be hard to beat Blueprint here. Then, the second highlight here for Blueprint is course structure. All of the Blueprint lesson work is smartly structured into these bite-sized learning modules and they spoon feed you exactly what you need to learn. These learning modules each consist of a series of video lessons, quizzes, short assignments, and drills. And the way they're all tied together in a single module make the prep program feel very integrated. Your daily study plan has a very nice, cohesive flow to it, and the varied approach in each module allows you to see and understand the same material from multiple perspectives. So we just really like Blueprint's curriculum design. And then lastly, the final thing I want to note for Blueprint is the video breakdowns of their passages and practice prompts. Some, but not all, practice problems in their course have videos accompanying them that explain how you should have solved the problem. The questions that do have video explanations are great. Much like the video lessons themselves, they're very well produced and the instructor insights are very useful. We obviously wish they had these for every single passage and problem, but even so, they add a ton of value to your studies. So that's Blueprint, the best on-demand video lectures that you can get, bite-sized learning modules that we absolutely loved, and solid problem explanations in video format. Now, before we move on to Kaplan, I just want to note something about price. It's really hard to compare the cost of these two MCAT prep packages because of how Blueprint does their pricing. For example, when looking at the self-paced courses, the Blueprint course can cost anywhere from just $1,200 all the way up to $2,500 depending on whether you want 6, 9, or 12 months of access, and whether you want printed books or just the eBooks. Now this is in comparison to Kaplan where it's just a flat cost of $2,000 for their self-paced course. So whether Blueprint is cheaper just totally depends on what content access period you choose and whether you want printed books. And it's the same for the live online packages as well. The Kaplan package costs a flat $2,700 while Blueprint's packages range from $2,600 up to $3,500. And one other factor here is that both companies are actually really good about running deals and discounts, and you can usually find their packages on sale for much less, so make sure to check for that as well because it can change the math. In fact, I'll do my best to drop any current discounts and coupon codes that I can find floating around out there down below the video screen for you. I routinely see both companies knock 10 to 20% off their prices, so make sure to check that out prior to purchasing. All right, so that's Blueprint. Now let's look at Kaplan's highlights. And the first thing that stands out to us about Kaplan is their live classes. Kaplan is maybe the best live class curriculum in all of MCAT prep. This is for a few reasons. One, the lesson plans for each live class are really efficient and thoughtfully designed. Two, the classes are integrated in a really cohesive way with the rest of the curriculum, meaning everything ties in really seamlessly. Three, most Kaplan instructors have been with the company for 10 plus years, so they understand Kaplan's content and strategies like the back of their hand and they're great at communicating some of the tougher concepts. 
Then four, the classes have a flex schedule so you can pick the date and time that works best for you each week rather than being locked into certain days and times. Number five, the class sizes are usually pretty small, usually fewer than 10 students per class that we saw. And lastly, six, they have two instructors for every class, one that actually teaches the class and one that works the live chat function. So you can always ask questions on the sly without interrupting the flow of the class. Basically, given the quality and structure of Kaplan's live instruction and lesson plans, if you're thinking that live classes are gonna be a central part of your study plan, then Kaplan is gonna be really hard to beat. And then the second highlight here is Kaplan's study plan. So one of the things that kind of confused us about Kaplan before we got in and reviewed this course was how they advertise how they have 700 plus hours of MCAT study material. That's great, but the AAMC only recommends about 300 hours of studying for the exam, so we wondered why they offered so much and seemed so proud of it. Well, it's because they have 700 hours worth of work, but they narrow it down to just what you need. The Kaplan study plan is super flexible and your assignments will shift around based on your strengths and weaknesses. If you're good on a subject, you can test out of it and you won't see much more practice or instruction for that topic, other than maybe some light refreshers. However, if you're weak, their algorithm will assign you more work for that topic and suggest optional readings and practice sets. Basically, Kaplan has a mountain of study material, but it's very smart in how they assign the work and have you work through it. You're never gonna see all 700 hours. And then lastly with Kaplan, we love their prep books. You get seven printed prep books when you sign up for the Kaplan MCAT course, and they are just money. They're detailed, yet easy to read, and make great use of graphics and bullet points for key concepts. In short, we just love them. So if you're a big text-based learner, you're likely gonna wanna go with Kaplan. Blueprint's prep books are decent in their own right, but they're nothing like Kaplan's. All right, so that about does it for the details, so let's get to my final thoughts. But real quick, before we dive into that, I should just mention that since you're studying for the MCAT, every single month here at Test Prep Insight, we actually give away a free prep course to one lucky person. It's super simple to enter and everyone is eligible. I'll put all the details down below in the description on how to get entered, but just know it takes like 10 seconds and hey, you never know, you could win a totally free MCAT prep course. Okay, the final verdict. Should you go with Blueprint or Kaplan for your MCAT prep? Well, I think the reality is that you can't go wrong with either of these courses. That's the good news. We give them both really high grades across the board and they're both rock solid. But there are some subtle differences between them here and we do think they fit different needs. For Blueprint, with how good their video lessons are and the smart course structure that they've used with gated learning modules, we think it's best for self-paced learners. So if you're going the self-guided route, we do like Blueprint. And then similarly, if you're going with live online classes, we like Kaplan. Their live classes are the best we've taken and when you combine that with their smart study planner and office hour sessions, it's a really powerful combo for students that want live instruction. But again, you really can't go wrong here. Anyway, I hope this video has been helpful and you learned a little something about both Blueprint and Kaplan. If so, please return the favor by subscribing to our channel, liking this video, and drop me a quick comment below. That would be really appreciated. And again, if you want to see that full detailed written comparison that I mentioned earlier in this video, just hop on over to our website. Again, that's testprepinsight.com. Or you can always check out the other videos we have on our YouTube channel. We've got a bunch of great video content out there. But as always, thanks for watching. Best of luck, and I'll see you in the next one.